Now through October 15th, we will be bringing you the stories of local Hispanics who are working, who their, whose work has made a significant impact in our community. News Channel 5's Charlie Keegan introduces us to one Boca Raton man whose job took him all the way to the White House. I find it very, very every picture has a story. Jacobo Goldstein lived every story. I used to sit in the second row of the press room. The Honduran native used to be a full-time White House correspondent. Sometimes I used to pinch myself and say, well, look where you are. The 79-year-old covered five presidencies. May 1st, I remember the date, 1997. Working mostly for CNN's Spanish-language radio outlets across the world. I try to be very honest. I don't take sides. I'm not political. I don't... I don't favor one guy. Goldstein says he felt like oftentimes Hispanics didn't feel represented in D.C. and didn't pay attention to the news coming from the Capitol. He wanted to show them how U.S. politics affected their world. I really am grateful. I was at the hottest place in the world to be, that everything always bounced off the White House. He retired to Boca Raton to care for his wife, who's since died of Alzheimer's. She was the greatest warrior you ever saw. The journalist Bug still lives. He writes a daily column for a Honduran newspaper and chimes in on U.S. and Mexican news radio stations. He can't give it up. I can't. I wouldn't. I'd, I'd, I'd be dead. There are too many stories to tell. In Boca Raton, Charlie Keegan, WPTV News Channel 5.